mobile phone. Live across America, Mike Horn and Paul Stern and What's Cooking on CRN Digital Talk Radio. Hey, welcome to the big What's Cooking program. I'm Michael Horn. Hello, Paul Stern. Hey, Michael Horn. A big show indeed. Excited all about today's edition of What's Cooking Today. It's America's food, wine, restaurant, travel, and entertainment show. Of course, coming to you from the CRN Broadcast Center in Hollywood, California. We have Garen Staglin with us today from the Staglin Family Vineyard. Paul and I are going to be heading up there uh, this coming weekend for this big uh, 16th annual music festival they have for mental health. Takes place on uh, September 11th, by the way, historic day this year at the uh, Staglin Family Vineyard in Rutherford, California. That's in the Napa Valley. Should be a good show talking to Garen Staglin about what is coming up there. And we'll talk about the good wines, too. Uh, indeed, excellent wines, but of course, uh, all for the good cause. Uh, doing it each and every year, that music festival. Last year, of course, the inimitable Pat Benatar rocked the house. And this year, it'll be country superstar Dwight Yoakam. Dwight Yoakam going to be there. If you're a country fan, if you like good rock classics, then uh, Dwight Yoakam is your man. And uh, by the way, the dinner they're having is a fine Texas cuisine dinner. And uh, Chef John Bonnell will be there. We'll be telling you about that just the same way. So uh, stay with us. And speaking of good food, Richard Binder is going to be here with us. We had him scheduled, oh, about a week and a half or so ago, and he was in a special meeting. He is back, Richard Binder, the general manager of uh, Philippe's The Original, and you're talking about those French dip sandwiches, your favorite, Paul Stern. Out of the French dip sandwich, this is where it all began. It's an incredible story, and it's one that's kind of been duplicated, I guess, across the country in many restaurants, but I don't think ever to the success that they have over at Philippe's. Besides the French dip, I know this is a uh, historic classic restaurant in uh, Los Angeles. Um, and I think the coffee is, what, nine cents to this day? It's like he's they held some of the prices back. They serve cups of regular coffee. For nine cents a cup, in honor of the old-fashioned prices. The, by the way, they had a price raise. By the way, it raised from five cents uh, from in 1977 up to nine cents. So that's really something. Yeah, it's a pretty interesting experience. It's like a landmark institution. It's the kind of thing that if you're ever coming to the Southern California area, you don't want to miss out on uh, experiencing what they got going on over at Philippe's. And the sandwich price is very, uh, very, very affordable. And not only the French dip, but they have what? They've got the, a pork dip sandwich. Yeah, I can't wait when we talk Lamb. to Richard Bender. He'll give us the complete history and rundown. But, yeah, they got a pork. They got, the, the, of course, the turkey. And a, a lot of people, and we'll, we'll ask Richard what this is all about, but I've been actually online. And when at Philippe's, you are online. That's how you kind of get served. Uh, I heard a young lad actually tell his father that he wanted to get the turkey dip. And the father, like, chastised. Like, why do you want to get the turkey really? dip? So we'll ask Richard Bender to, if indeed there is a hesitation. Turkey dip is delicious, by the way. You With the mustard. Oh, my gosh. I, I you bet know what? It's, it's, the, it's the bun and the meat. It's the quality of the food. And he's also got this wine list there. He uh, added this himself, Richard Bender. put in. You get a, a glass of silver oak. It's just incredible. By the way, I was in the beautiful uh, Sonoma County area for the uh, Sonoma Country Wine Weekend. And unfortunately, you did the broadcast with us, Paul. We heard that yesterday on the show, but you were not there. And I happened to stop by the Silver Oak facility, and that wine is drinking good. <laughs> okay. How do you actually say that? I don't think that's part of the commercial. Yeah, I learned this on the old Andy Griffith show. <laughs> I think it was when Gomer came by, or maybe it was Goober, came by, uh, or maybe Andy came by the filling station, and they asked Goober how the wine was drinking, <laughs> and Goober said the wine is drinking good. Yeah, I, I don't and, think that's how hey, Andy is drinking good. Yeah, I don't Come think that's on how in. Have some ice cream and some of this new fire water. Good. Yeah, that's not exactly how Dick Heatherson puts it in the commercial. Hey, we bring this show to the common people. You can get your sommeliers talking about what the essence of the notes were and the okay. cherries and the dried prunes and whatever they got in there. Right. We'll just tell you. Get over there to Silver Oak, get a bottle of that over right. at Philippe's The Original, and it is drinking good, Andy. Mmm, boy. Mmm, doggies. For over 30